A volleyball team from Murfreesboro, Tennessee is asking for support tonight. One of their players was critically injured by a reckless driver in downtown St. Louis this weekend. Fox 2's Jeff Bernthal has reaction from the site of this weekend's tournament. Witty, tough, persistent. Those are just a few of the words used to describe volleyball player Janae Edmondson. This is a hard road for a young athlete who last week committed to play college volleyball at a local Division II university in Tennessee. Video of the crash was captured by nearby cameras. A witness tells us the reckless driver sped through a yield sign at 11th and St. Charles, crashed into another vehicle, struck Edmondson on a sidewalk, and then flipped over. The driver was arrested. Edmondson lost both of her legs. A lot of sadness that we can't find words to describe right now. Uh, there's a lot of anger and we have words to the anger. Um, you know, this was a street sign that wasn't obeyed. And uh, in an instant, this young person's world and her family's world changed. Edmondson will likely be hospitalized in St. Louis for weeks. A GoFundMe has been established to help with expenses when she returns home. We're trying to build a, a foundation for an easy transition the best we can when she does get home. So any, any support that can happen would be much appreciated. Players and parents are ready to offer support. Some had their own close calls with dangerous driving in St. Louis. They're not stopping at the stoplights, stop signs. You know, it's, it's bad. It's dangerous. We were standing on the sidewalk and the city bus almost hit some of the girls on our team because they cut the corner too close. We will have a link to the GoFundMe at Fox 2 now. Edmondson's team tells me they're grateful for the support that they felt here in St. Louis. That includes from tournament organizers, other teams, and first responders. Coming up on Fox 2 News at 10, a witness who saw the crash. Reporting from downtown, Jeff Berthal, Fox 2 News.